Is there anything more manly in life than having good eyesight? Think about it. Eye doctor charts are a welcomed challenge to men. FDP LTCEO. We're all self-proclaimed masters at speed reading. And we love being known as Eagle Eye when it comes to any kind of target practice. Hey, nobody's perfect. Hey guys, Robbie Sondag here with a little godly advice for living a more meaningful life. Well, the Bible is filled with all kinds of stories regarding eyesight. You've got Samson having his eyes gouged out, Jesus healing the blind, Saul being blinded by the light. But today's verse has more to do with vision than it does with eyesight. It comes from Proverbs 29, 18, where it says, Where there is no vision, the people perish. But he that keeps the law, happy is he. Well, when we were kids, we learned all about following the rules, even if we didn't like them. There were rules at school, rules at home, rules in sports. And as adults, we have rules or laws to obey as well. There are work-related rules. There are driving laws to follow. There are basic guidelines for living a civilized life. That is, if we decide to grow up. We are, after all, selfish by nature. And if we're smart, we learn to transition from that childhood where the world revolves around us into the adult mature life where we can focus on serving others. And this is particularly true in the spiritual sense. This verse is telling us that where there is no vision, the people will perish. Vision here is referring to God's guidance or direction. And to perish here means to cast off restraint or to run wild, kind of like you describe a little kid or perhaps a young adult who doesn't get it. In fact, you may even know a few older guys who are living like boys. Well, this verse is telling us that where God's directions aren't followed, we can expect chaos. Know anyone living a chaotic life? I do. However, the second part of this verse tells us that he who keeps the law is happy or blessed or joyful. Guys, life's hard enough. Following God should be a given. Let's don't make this harder than it has to be. Read your Bible and follow God daily, and your life will be blessed. And trust me, that's not the kind of thing you want to find out in hindsight. So yes, there is something more manly in life than having good eyesight. It's learning to follow God's vision for living a blessed life, where you can be sure to hit the mark. Close enough. Hey, if you'd like a weekly dose of humor, truth, and encouragement, or maybe you just struggle to get into the Word with any kind of regularity, do me a favor. Go ahead and subscribe to this channel so that we can at least chew on a verse once a week together. And to do that, all you have to do is click the subscribe button and the notification bell so you don't miss a single episode. And make sure to check out this week's bonus video where we will gain invaluable insight from a blind man. And we will see you around.